What we have here is an air pressure control system. We're controlling the amount of air pressure inside that black plastic pipe, and we're doing so using a red control valve, pneumatically actuated, and we're measuring the amount of pressure in the system with a pressure transmitter. But something else we've added to the system is a safety shutdown. We have this pressure switch right here. It's a United Electric Control switch, and it is monitoring the pressure and then also providing a switch contact output that goes to a relay circuit. The idea being if the pressure ever rises to a uh, value that's too high, let's say for example our regulatory system stops working or something gets plugged up and we cannot regulate pressure, if the switch detects that the pressure has gone too high, it activates a solenoid valve which shuts off the air supply to the tank and also vents what pressure is in the tank. So we're going to simulate that condition right now. I'm going to have the operator place the valve in manual mode, 0% and we will see the stem of that valve go down to zero and that'll uh, not vent any air. There it goes and then you could hear the sound of the solenoid venting and now our air pressure is down at a safe level because our safety trip system has taken over. You can also see that our relay right here is on showing us we're in a latch status. Go ahead and open the valve back up again. Now we're going to open up this control valve and allow the pressure to restabilize in the vessel but being a latching safety system, it's relying on me to push a push button over here to get it out of the latch state. And now it's working again. And it's rearmed and it's able to trip the system if it needs to once more.